How are we going guys? The Loot Gamer over here and welcome to another episode of Really Cool Gaming Loot. Over here people, we got the new Nintendo Switch Lite and I want to sort of show you guys all the really awesome details of this. As we can see fellas, we get ourselves three different colors and lots of cool comparisons and differences. The first thing that I want to sort of show you guys is, a, is of course it's a lighter, it's got a smaller screen and it's got longer battery life over here. But to go through all of the details of this Switch in case you guys want to see what's the differences is of course on the left as we can see we've got the Nintendo Switch and on the right the new Switch Lite and as you can sort of see over here the play mode so of course with the normal Nintendo Switch you get the TV tablet and handheld with the Switch Lite all you get is just the handout object only so in case you guys got an issue with you know trying to play this on your TV that may be a deal breaker but for me honestly I would never play my Switch on the TV I would just rather play my PC games on the TV or my PlayStation games so a handout object for me is perfectly fine uh, compatible games, all Switch games work on this, but the Switch games that support a handheld mode only. So next sort of difference here is the Joy-Con controllers are included, but with the HD rumble and IR motion camera. Unfortunately, with this Switch Lite, guys, there's none of that. So we get no HD rumble or IR motion camera. So in case you guys play games that support that, with the Nintendo Switch Lite, unfortunately, we won't get that. With the Nintendo Switch dock over here, um, it comes with a dock. With this one, it comes with no dock, and it's also not compatible with a dock either. So in case you guys wanted that, unfortunately, fellas, we don't get that. The dimensions, of course, for the normal Nintendo Switch is 4 inches by 9.5 long, but this one over here is 3.6 by 8.2 long, so a bit smaller. So in case you guys got smaller hands, that would be absolutely perfect to actually put together. So honestly, for me, I would prefer something a bit smaller, which I have no problem with. The weight over here is 0.88 IBS, but the approximate weight for this new light is 0.61, so a lot lighter, guys, in case you guys want to have that. The screen, of course, is 6.2 on the original versus 5.5. So in case you guys game on your iPhones, if you've got like, a, if you've got like an iPhone XS Max or something like that, it'll be a little bit smaller, 0.2 smaller. So that's sort of the sort of display that we'll be getting there. The battery life, of course, is 30 minutes longer on this new light compared to uh, 2.5 compared to 3. So you're getting about an extra 30 minutes of battery life, which is pretty neat. So it's good to see that, you know, we're getting some sort of uh, feature and benefit from it. But it even tells you, yeah, the battery life will depend on the games you play. For instance, the, battle, the battery will last approximately 3 hours with The Legend of Zelda, and it'll last 4 hours using the light as well. So it's good to see that. But also, let's have a read over here on the game compatibility. So Nintendo Switch plays games in the Nintendo Switch library that support handheld. For games that do not support handheld mode, players can wirelessly connect compatible controllers to Nintendo Switch Lite. If using separate Joy-Con controllers, users will need to have a device to, re to recharge them, such as a Joy-Con charging grip. To find play mode compatible information for specific gamers, please refer to the product packaging or Nintendo eShop. So unfortunately guys, that's another sort of uh, marketing technique they're using. You'll, you'll actually have to buy another controller to actually use that. So that's kind of disappointing there, but those are the differences. So at the bottom of here, of course, is a summary. All you get guys is handheld compared to all of the other features on, on, the, on the Nintendo Switch. Let me know in the comments below what you guys think of that. For me, it's actually not a deal breaker at all. I really don't mind it. But some more news that I want to sort of show you guys now is this really awesome special Pokemon edition of new Switch Lite system. And just have a look at how beautiful this looks like. Looks absolutely epic. The blue with the pink there with the gorgeous looking screen. They didn't really specify what, what kind of, um, I would say, resolution the screen was. I'm assuming it'll be the same as the normal Nintendo Switch. But as you guys know, as you go smaller on the screen with the same resolution, it may look a bit more sharper. But have a look at this gorgeous looking device guys i am absolutely gonna pick this up it looks so cool let me know at the comments below but in case you guys are wondering this actually drops on the 8th of november so you know at the same price point of 200 dollars. so this is going to be a really epic sort of holiday gift to get for the kids let me know at the comments below but honestly for me guys this nintendo switch Lite is looking pretty hot 100 dollars cheaper compared to the original yes we don't get all the features but for me i won't really be playing this on tv i'll be playing this on hand handheld object but let me know in the comments below i am the loot gamer if, if you feel this enjoy give me a thumbs up and a like because i want to bring you guys some more awesome loot i'm definitely going to be picking this up are you guys going to be picking this up or just going to pass i am the loot gamer thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you later deuces